welcome to my spring term podcast. Well, the school's looking lovely. It's a vibrant learning place. We're offset ready. We're always offset ready. Being an outstanding academy is all about delivering high quality learning, high quality attainment, high quality family care, and a really rich provision all of the time. You'll know that it's lovely doing this job, and I spend a lot of my time teaching. That way I get a real good feel for what the children are learning. I also get a good feel for how the teachers are teaching and it's really nice to be involved with the children. Today I'm in year one, but I want to show you what's going on around the rest of the school. And there's some lovely learning going on in year one. But something that really excites me is not just learning taking place in class, but learning taking place out of class. And our learning culture is such at Thames for instance that we encourage children working independently or collaboratively out of class. That's a really, really special treat. Thank you for either lending or purchasing a PC. The iPads are going really well. Just some top tips though, yeah? Please make sure it's charged. Please encourage your child to look after it, give it a wipe down. Two hands when holding it. Cyberbullying, the dangers of the internet, all of that we teach the children, but you need to keep an eye on them at home. And if something does come up that's not right, it's exit, tell a grown up so we can fix it. And of course, Facebook, no. Children under the age of 13 are not allowed on Facebook. And it's just about being mindful of that. Please help give us the same messages to your children as we're, as we're giving them at school. PE is something we take very, very seriously at Thames U Infant School. I like PE. Year 2 will go in swimming soon, so look out for information about that. All the other classes in Key Stage 1, well, they have PE twice a week. And I'm looking for two hours of high quality PE. Gymnastics, dance and games. Children need their PE kit. We sell it from the school office. We always have spares, but it's so important for you, for children to have their own. Attainment, you know, is something that I feel very, very strongly about. All children really have an entitlement to leave this school as clever as they really, really can be. So we're working really hard at the moment throughout the school to help, that, to help every child do their very, very best. Please bring your school child to school every single day. When they're early, then they need to stay at home and convalesce. But other times, bring them in. If you've got some spare time and you would like to come and help, please come and see me. We'll do some checks and then it will be in on you doing some stuff in school that benefits you and really helps our children. And please, it's the law. Your child should be reading every night at school. Please make sure they're on the right book band. If your child is, say, like reading green and is bringing home orange books or turquoise books, see the class teacher, talk to them, find out. If your child's on purple and you think they might be ready for gold, then again, come and talk to us. And when you see children reading beyond gold, from white to lime green and copper, then it really, really is very, very complex text. And it's about making sure children really understand what's going on. It's not just about reading the words, it's inference and meaning beyond the literal. And my staff are going to be running some drop-ins for you in the next couple of weeks, so you can find out a little bit more about that. Lovely, isn't it? I'm very, very proud of our children. They're really great assets to our community. They really are acquiring the skills for later life. They do learn exceptionally well. So, some key things though, yeah? Did you know that every child's got their own individual writing, reading target? And they should be able to tell you that. They've also got their own maths target. If they're not sure of it, check with the class teacher. They'll tell you what it is. And there's all that homework. Copies of the school homework live all on the school website. And there's our wonderful top tip for learning videos. We made some videos to show you some of the learning that's going on in school and help, help unpick some of the teaching methods that might have changed from when you were a child. And you know, things go wrong. But we empower our children to resolve things when things are not right. So, 
what happens in the playground, and because you're not practiced this every, what happens in the playground when something happens? What do you say to that person? Do you love you hurt me? Do you love you hurt me? Do you love you? I don't like that. And that's the first point of call. That's what you do. And if someone does say that, what's the law in our school? If someone says that to you, what do you need to say? What do we say back to them? We say, sorry, and then we... Are you okay? And we... And we sort it out. Yeah? And that takes a lot of practice. We start that in nursery, we build it through reception, and it blossoms in year two. It doesn't always get right. At, uh, it doesn't always work. Our staff will intervene, our staff, our staff can carefully manage those relationships. But if something doesn't go right and you hear about it at home, it's about saying, did you talk about it, did you sort it out, and if not, did you talk to a teacher, and are you happy? But don't forget that, although on one hand it's important that I'm teaching in classes, seeing what the learnings are like and helping to raise standards and continue our standards, it's also important that I'm available for you to talk to. You know how to get hold of me. I tweet, we're on YouTube, there's a dedicated email address, or you can just pop into the office. And if I'm available, I'll always, I'll always be able to talk to you and, and sort things out. So, it's a very, very exciting term. There's lots to get, um, there's lots going on, there's lots to look forward to, and um, I hope to see you around school soon. Bye for now.